Investment, Sales Operations, Via America, Eric Watson. Good morning, and thank you for joining us for the introduction of the Kia Concept EV3 and EV4. What do you think? Pretty good. Kia has a history of turning exciting concept cars into real world vehicles, and these two will be no different. We'll tell you more about that in a moment. First, let's talk about how we get from where we are today to the electrified future these concept vehicles represent. With Kia's growing collection of JD Power IQS Dependability and Appeal Awards, it's clear that we are building great products that customers truly want to buy. Demand for our product is at all-time highs, and Kia has delivered 15 consecutive months of year-over-year -year sales growth. Year-to-date, our U.S. sales are up 15%, and that's well ahead of industry. In fact, Kia's year-to-date sales are up by more than any other mainstream brand versus the same period in 2019 prior to the pandemic. And we're on pace for our seventh consecutive annual retail sales record. We've seen growth across our entire lineup, including Carnival, Celto, Sportage, Telluride, Forte, Sorento, and more. And with our hybrid and plug-in hybrid options on Sportage and Sorento, we're attracting even more customers to the brand. Our SUVs and EVs are our greatest strengths, with Kia utility vehicles up 19.5% this year, and they now account for 72% of our total sales. At the same time, our electrified models are up an impressive 49%. While there's been a lot of talk about Kia EVs or about EVs lately, Kia continues to be firmly committed to offering a wide range of hybrid, plug-in hybrid, and full battery electric vehicles. Nero was our first step with three powertrain options. Then EV6 showed the world that Kia is an EV leader. It was the first EV in North America to win the North America Utility Vehicle of the Year and World Performance Car of the Year, both in the same year. This brings us to the Kia EV9, the industry's first mass market three row EV SUV. It's electric like you've never seen before. And we're proud to say that the EV9 is a NAC toy finalist. It's our fourth Kia vehicle to receive such an honor. So that's fantastic. The EV9 will begin to arrive at our dealerships in the coming weeks, and we're confident it will change the game again. To help meet future demand for EVs, we're investing $200 million in our West Point, Georgia plant to assemble the EV9 there in 2024, making it the first Kia EV to be assembled locally here in the US. So what's next in our electrified journey? We're committed to accelerating electric adoption by bringing more choices to the market at affordable price points in the industry's strongest selling segment. That's what these concept vehicles are all about, enabling us to offer options with MSRPs anticipated to range from $35 to $50,000, making EV ownership more accessible than ever. Second, we'll continue to expand our global EV production and supply facilities, increasing to eight by 2025, including a new dedicated plant in the US just outside of Savannah, Georgia. At this location, we're also investing $4.6 billion in a battery joint venture to supply the rapid increase of US assembled Kia EVs. Third, Kia is investing with six other automakers to develop an extensive charging infrastructure to make charging more convenient for all customers. And finally, Kia is working to foster circularity within the EV battery ecosystem by promoting innovative practices from raw material extraction to recycling of used batteries. Of course, Plan S reaches beyond motors and batteries in the, in the pursuit of sustainable mobility. We're also partnering with the ocean cleanup to not only remove trash from our oceans, but to prevent it from getting there. Here's a look at Interceptor 007, which has been blocking trash from entering the Pacific Ocean at Bologna Creek right here in LA since 2022. And for our part, we will be using recycled materials collected by the ocean cleanup in our future EVs. And now to tell you more about the concept EV3 and EV4, 
Please welcome our chief designer in the US, Tom Kearns. Good morning, thank you, Eric. Good morning, everyone. You know, our concept EV3 and EV4 highlight Kia's commitment to delivering accessible EVs for everyone. They also reveal how our Opposites United design language is evolving to embrace our electrified future. EVs open up new possibilities in both layout and shape, enabling us to create entirely new types of vehicles. And that's the idea behind concept EV4. Looking at the side of the vehicle, the combination of the low hood and long tail really stand out among traditional sedans. You don't often see roof spoilers on sedans. Here, it works with the long deck to create a very unique silhouette. At the leading edge, the wide stance creates a bold and purposeful impression. The front comes to life with geometric details and patterns that make a high-tech statement. While the star map light, inspired by our stargazing optimism of the future, the rear of the Concept EV4 is no less innovative, featuring a wide and clean bumper highlighted at each end by vertical tail lamps. And the interior features a horizontal, wide architecture with a very modern aesthetic. The IP is slim and subtly driver-focused. The clean cabin wraps around you like a cocoon, complete with a rear bench that's as inviting as your living room couch. And that's the Concept EV4 a fresh, bold, unexpected design. So now let's take a look, closer look at Concept EV3, an ideal offering for those who go their own way and are open to new experiences. As we move to the side, you see the dynamic roof line with a geometric body. The shape and surface of the body side are defined by the strong architecture of squared wheel arches cut with asymmetrical angles. And by pushing the windscreen as far forward as possible, we've allowed for a spacious cabin while maintaining an agile silhouette. Up front, the Concept EV3 expresses a tough and high-tech attitude with a new evolved Tiger face. Vertical headlamps emphasize the width of the vehicle, and of course, we've employed Kia's signature star map lighting. On the rear, boxy fenders and a full tailgate give the vehicle a very muscular appearance. As in the front, the rear lamps incorporate the star map lighting signature, creating an impression of width and framing the tailgate surface. The disconnected C-pillar flows smoothly into the vehicle's broad shoulders, giving Concept EV3 a purposeful stance. And inside, we're adhering to our design philosophy, Opposites United, by melding cues from consumer product design with automotive interior style. The door trim's clean and uncluttered vertical elements inspire a sense of calm and extend the horizontal theme of the IP. The bench type seats welcome you to relax and connect with others. While the console armrest offers a useful table and ample storage. Compact and innovative with a flexible interior environment. This is concept three. EVs are the future, and we're excited for the EV3 and EV4 to arrive. However, to build towards the vision of Plan S, we must also sell vehicles to our customers that they want today. And that means we will continue to make an excellent line of SUVs even better. Today, we'll show you just how we're gonna do that with our hot selling midsize Kia Sorento. I just want the new thing. Oh, they tell me to be cool. Don't want to hear about no rules. I gotta get it my way. Cause I just want the new thing. 
Kia Sorento X-Pro plug-in hybrid and hybrid models. Even more choices to appeal to new Sorento customers and those who already love it. Thanks to our California-based design team, the new Sorento looks bolder and sleeker than ever, drawing on EV9 and Telluride DNA. Sorento's broad and rectangular front grille is pure EV9, complemented by vertically stacked LED projector headlights. The front bumper incorporates a wider skid blade, and the upright front hood and squared off edges are inspired by Telluride, with distinctive amber daytime running lights reimagined for Sorento. Around back, the all new bumper features a more rugged design with an integrated rear skid plate, and the vertical taillights are now a single unit with a boxy technical appearance. And note the star map lighting elements, front and rear, a signature Kia Q you can't miss day or night. Inside, we streamlined the cabin and enhanced the feeling of openness with horizontal features such as the air vents and controls. But truly what makes this Sorento update exciting is the addition of the adventurous and off-road capable X-Pro model that our customers love on Telluride and Sportage. The 2024 Sorento X-Pro includes knobby 17-inch BF Goodrich all-terrain tires, increased ground clearance, a 4,000-pound towing capacity, exclusive X-Pro emblems and embossed front seats, as well as new color options inside and out. There's much more to the Sorento story than just its confident new design. So to share the rest of the details, please welcome Russell Wagner. Thank you, Tom. And I have to say, the X-Pro treatment looks great on the new Sorento. Earlier, Eric told you about our lineup of capable SUVs. And just a few weeks ago, we wrapped up our fourth Rebel Rally, a grueling test involving 1,500 miles of rocky trails, steep dunes, spreading across the Nevada and California deserts. Kia's team competed in the Rebel X-Cross class with a modified 2024 Kia Telluride X-Pro and took the podium. Perhaps you'll see Sorento X-Pro in next year's competition. A striking family resemblance and an X-Pro model aren't the only things Sorento shares with Telluride. It also gets an infusion of technology that Telluride has, including popular features like the available panoramic curved display that seamlessly integrates dual 12.3 inch screens. Additionally, the new Sorento gets standard wireless Apple CarPlay and Android Auto across all trims. And behind the upgraded display is our next generation ultra modern connected car navigation cockpit system. It's faster, puts frequently used quick controls at your fingertips, and enables over-the-air updates so your Sorento experience can improve over time. We've also added available Digital Key 2.0, which enables access to the vehicle in engine starts and stops, and even the ability to share the key with others remotely, all from the driver's smartphone. Plus, Sorento delivers an impressive suite of convenience and technology advancements our customers have come to expect, including driver assist systems that are even more advanced than today's model. Look for the new Sorento X-Pro in Kia showrooms in the first quarter of next year, with the hybrid and PHEV following a bit later. Building award-winning SUVs like Sorento and expanding our family of EVs is our job, it's what we do. But the true purpose of the Kia brand is to drive thinking, inspiration, and progress. And that's why we continue to invest in saving lives and supporting communities through our Accelerate the Good program. Let me give you a powerful example of why we do this and why it matters. This is Aspen, a patient at St. Jude's Children's Research Hospital. 
She appeared in our Joyride TV spot last December. When we first met Aspen, she was undergoing treatment for cancer. Today, at age eight, she is completely cancer free. This is one reason why we are once again making a donation for every new Kia vehicle purchased or leased between today and January 2nd with a guaranteed minimum donation of $1.5 million. In the spirit of giving, we can't wait to help St. Jude bring even more smiles to even more children's faces this year. With that, we thank you for your attention this morning I invite you to join us for a closer look at our EV concepts, the new Sorento, and please also check out our EV9 vehicle to home display right behind me. Thank you all very much. Have a great afternoon.